Company. And as we continue with this free shipping promotion, here's another one that I love, love, love. Um, this is what I keep my cookbooks on. And we don't normally have this at this price, and we just do not have this free shipping. I mean, we're all kind of sitting up and taking notice. It's like free shipping, free shipping, free shipping. Free shipping is done at, well, technically tomorrow, although this may be the last, um, well, actually, this wasn't even a scheduled show, <laughs> come to think of it, because our customers really demanded that we uh, bring origami to prime time tonight, because uh, all these offers are expiring. So what is it? It is that same concept of the origami technology, which is if you're channel surfing, it's that ancient art of paper folding, so there's really no assembly. Uh, go figure. Uh, a book shelf or a bookcase that you don't have to assemble. I think the bookcase that I had in my dormitory at Moorhead State University when I went to college in like 1988 is still there <laughs> because there's no way once you put it together you were ever getting that thing disassembled again. All you do is you pick your color of choice. And Steve, I think we've got both the metallic silver, vintage bronze, and metallic gold. Are those my choices? Okay. So uh, metallic gold, vintage bronze, and then that um, metallic silver, which is a, a nice brush design. Tracy Rosa is back in her beautiful home. <laughs> Tracy, I told you this the other day. Okay, so um, we all know we're working from home and I, can't, I really, we thank you so much for inviting us into your beautiful home. But with this origami in particular, it's really not even a prop. I see your gorgeous house right. that you spent so much money on remodeling and you and your family, you guys did such a great job. But correct me if I'm wrong. Is that so? That no. So that is not like a prop. They, you, they, these no. live in your home, right? Oh, 100. percent And to be honest with you, too much information, Tracy. I have two. I have one that sits right here, and then I had another one. Honest to goodness, truth. The other day, Shannon, I come home. I, I said to my husband, I'm like, Miguel, where's the other origami? He said, I've to start. I've decided to start collecting bourbon. So it's in the bar now. So he stole my origami from this side of the table, put it in his office, and now he's collecting bourbon on it. So if it tells you that it's good for bourbon, it's good for the living room, it's good for any room in your house, we're not kidding when it comes to origami. And when you think of bookshelves, Shannon, I think that people think of a couple different things. First, they think of they have to hire somebody to come in and permanently install bookshelves. Or they think of particle board, all right? Or they think of a shelving system like this that requires multiple steps when putting stuff together, right? Uh-uh, not with this one. This is out of the box, ready to go. So you take it out of the box, wait for it. You open it up, all the shelves fall perfectly in place. Here's that famous origami toggle right here. You take this in, you feed this through. That's gonna lock the bottom shelves in place. You swing this top shelf over, ready? That's your assembly, now you're good to go. The dimensions on this, the weight capacity on this is crazy. So it stands about five feet, five inches tall. I'm about five, three, so just a little taller than me. Two feet across, but check this out. Only 11 inches off the wall. So it's not too big, it's not too bulky. Like you said, it's kind of the Goldilocks of origami because each one of these shelves, listen up, holds 50 pounds worth of weight. 50 pounds, okay? So this is gonna hold 300 pounds worth of weight on each one of these racks. Now, remember it's powder coated steel, so it will not rust, it won't chip, it won't corrode. But look at this beautiful lattice design. So when I first got this home, I'm like, oh my gosh, that's so nice of origami to give me such a beautiful decorative piece. It's gonna look great in my TV room. But then I realized, yeah, it's, it's decorative, but it's so functional. It's a bookshelf. You need something on the sides right here to keep things from falling off. So I love this, Shannon. I love that I'm able to put this in my family room right here. I put, you know, the practical things. I've got my books right here, but then I add some cute little tchotchkes. I've got my succulents right here. I've got my fun things, but then I've also got the dog toys, the dog treats. I've also got, you know, some bins right here because I'm a sucker for bins. I throw everything in there because it's like out of sight, out of mind. But look at how great. Let me just kind of move out of the way here. Look at how great it looks right here. Like I said, I normally have two flanking this table, but it just gives me, if I could move this out of the way, you could see that this is just a blank wall right here. There's nothing here. And I think that people can completely relate to that. Most people have several areas in their home that is unutilized 
wall space. Imagine being able to take that space and giving it 12 linear feet of storage space. Because like I said, each one of these shelves is two feet across. There are six tiers, so it's going to be 12 linear feet. So you're going up instead of going out. And when you have that powder coated steel, you can do this wherever you want. It can be outside, on your lanai, on your patio, on your porch. It can be by your grill. It can be in your garage because it's so sturdy, holds 300 pounds worth of weight. But then again, it's so slim, it can fit in any bathroom. So you're only taking up about 11 inches off of the wall five and a half feet there, but imagine the amount of stuff that you can store on here. All of your towels you can roll up, all of your paper towels or your toilet paper. You can put bins of your hair stuff on here, then take it to the office. Have all your books, all of your office supplies right there and all of the kids' room. This can be their shelving system in there where they put their stuffed animals or their box, um, their boxes of puzzles or their games and all of that. It really is just gonna be that great solution for any open wall space that you have in your home. It, it is, and if, if I can, you know, it's to me, and this is my own opinion for what it's worth, I think this and the stainless steel top island cart, that kitchen cart. In fact, Steve, I don't know if we can even show that on hsn.com. Of course, that's, I'm always in the kitchen, so that's always gonna be a favorite of mine. But I think those are the prettiest origamis that we sell. I mean, I do, I just, I, I'm, maybe I'm playing favorites because I do use this as um, store decor, as, as Lou often says, because I just, with that um, almost like lattice work on the sides, it has, it's practical with a purpose because if you are using this as a bookshelf, I, I always say when I'm on the air with Tracy with this, I never get it on sale and I don't get that free shipping. And by the way, you won't either after this show. Um, I don't know if there are any scheduled shows tomorrow, but this could easily be your last airing of it with that free shipping. Shipping goes away after tomorrow. So it's it's pretty much, it's awfully close to a half off sale. I mean, it's getting dangerously close around there. Um, I love that we've got a customer pick review from a happy grandma. I'll read that for you guys, but I, I do have to tell you, you gotta get it at home. Any piece of air origami, I promise you it will not be your last. I have so very many of the origami products. I love, love the ease of setting them up and the strength they have to get me organized. You will never go wrong purchasing this product. Works in every room in the house. And Cheryl, we couldn't agree more. You know, Tracy, we have said it repeatedly, and we're going to say it again when we get to the two-pack of racks in just a few moments, but assess your space. I can mm -hmm. promise you, whether you're using this in the kitchen for cookbooks or whether you're using it, you know, for maybe as that, that bar area to show off maybe those great decanters or those bottles that you're collecting, if you are using it for toys, if you're using it for, you know, basically as, um, like a little linen closet because so many of our linens are, are just really pretty or if you're just using it for decor as Tracy's doing in her beautiful home you just can't go wrong but you really can't go wrong at this price or with this free shipping right Trace? No, 100%. And again, I think about, like, I have this random little closet in the laundry room. It didn't have shelving when we first got it. My husband and I kind of debated it. We're like, should we add shelving in there just to maximize the surface space? But you know what shelving does? It's permanent. You have to have somebody come in and do it. Or it's going to take my husband a whole day to do it. If I try to do it, I'm pretty sure it's going to come out wrong because I know that that's not my forte. And the thing that I laugh about that, it's a storage closet. So if anything falls behind it, we're kind of stuck, like it's hard to get to that area. If I wanna clean behind it, it's hard to get there. When you have origami at your home, you know, it's very easy. It's gonna fit in that very, very small space. Remember, two feet across, 11 inches deep. I love this design right here, Shannon. I don't know if you can see. Can you see that you've got that perforate? Yeah, there you go. The perforated shelves. It's not your standard shelving with those racks, with those open racks. Um, I was laughing, you know, Helen Keeney, one of the other hosts here at HSN, she had this on her Facebook page. She had it outside, she lives in a condo. She had it outside on her porch and it had all of her orchids. She uh, collects orchids. Oh. And I'm like, what a great what a great way to use this because like she could water everything right here. All of the water falls through cuz it's aerated and it won't rust, it won't chip or corrode. Other shelving systems if you used it for like a plant base, you'd have to take the plant off, right? Take it to another area, go ahead water it because you wouldn't want the water to drip because it would cause damage to the shelving system. This one, 
dude, take this indoors, outdoors, whatever you want, to the garage, to the family room, to the kitchen, wherever. And let's say you're not using it. Okay, like, I'll be honest with you. I use one of these during the holiday season because I take my holiday fancy plates out of storage and I want them on display. So I put it in that nice little corner in the dining room, but I break one of these down, all right? And I, that's the only time I use it. So when I'm not using it, this is what it stores to. Absolutely nothing, like three inches worth of space. It can go under a bed, under a sofa, between the washer and dryer, just in a small corner, any nook and cranny. And then when you want it, look at this, ready? This is your assembly. You open it up, that's it. All the shelves fall perfectly into place. Here's your famous origami toggle. You take that now, you feed it through. Top shelf is already attached. Swing that one over and now you're ready to go. Remember, 50 pound weight capacity per shelf. That's not for the whole unit, okay? That's per shelf. So 300 pounds when it comes to this bookshelf. You've got that beautiful lattice on the side. You still got some great colors, which will complement any decor that you have in your home. But look at this right here. That space was empty. Now it has 12 linear feet of storage space. Well, it's, it's, I say it's, it's pretty with a purpose. And it's one of the things that Tracy just showed you, but part of the reason that I, I have one of these in my kitchen right now, it's not only for my cookbooks, but um, this is this, the way these shelves are designed is actually unique to this bookshelf. In fact, I don't think there are any other racks that have this effect. You know what, Chris, I can tilt this down. This is what Tracy was showing off in her home. But um, rather than the wires uh, or, you know, like the bars, that uh, a lot of the other origamis have. This has almost like that mesh design that we're talking about, which is great if you are using it for plants or seedlings or orchids, but it's also great if you are putting canned goods on this like I do, and you don't want the can, you want the cans to remain level, um, even if it is for some of your, well, if it's for your decorative items, as, I mean, certainly that really comes into play where it shows off any of your decorative items beautifully. <laughs> Metallic silver, the vintage bronze, or that wonderful brushed gold. Those are your choices. And remember, with free shipping, this, I believe, is your last scheduled show of origami. Now, things are always subject to change here at HSN. This was a last-minute programming adjustment based on you and our customer response. So we thank you for that. But do not let that free shipping pass you by. I'm serious about this because if that has been the deterrent for you to try this or any origami, because ordinarily the shipping, first of all, it's not free, but normally it's in the neighborhood, especially on those large racks hovering around a $20 mark. Um, oh, by the way, speaking of free shipping, if you haven't grabbed the stainless steel cart yet, do so. That is, that is legit. That is a stainless steel top that literally opens and closes so you can sanitize it in your kitchen. Like um, we used to do the butcher block design. I like that one better because I cook with a lot of poultry and fish and things like that. Get it while the getting's good. So Tracy, well, I hope that you and your family have a blessed Easter Sunday. Thanks for coming in, my friend. It's always my pleasure, my friend. And my friends are saving a steak for me, so I'm gonna go grab that steak dinner that I was gonna have a couple hours ago, but I wanted to be here for your show. <laughs> I really appreciate it, I really do. Tracy, thank you again. Love to you and the whole family. Enjoy your day tomorrow. Hopefully they'll let you have thank the day you off. <laughs> thank you Happy Easter, Shannon. Hey, thanks, Tracy. All right, don't hang up. All right, so the famous origami rack, and I say famous,